So today Rudnick and I are going to teach you guys how to clean a horse's hoof. But Rudnick doesn't wear shoes. He's barefoot 24-7. I've never put shoes on him. His hoof care is pretty straightforward. A horse that has shoes is going to require a different kind of cleaning and hoof care. But I'm going to show you guys basically a generalized cleaning of a barefoot hoof. So because Rudnick is trained to pick up his feet for me, it definitely makes this a lot easier. So we're just going to ask him to pick up his foot. Thank you. And so when we have the foot up, you can see here, he has a little bit of manure kind of stuck in the crease here along his hoof. Now his foot's very dry right now, which is not a bad thing. He just had his feet trimmed um, about a week or so ago. You can see his frog here is quite worn down. We don't trim his frog just because you want to leave as much cushion as possible and it will break down naturally as they move around. So you can see this foot's really not that dirty. He just kind of had some manure along the frog there. So we're just gonna kind of scrape it out, make sure there's no rocks or anything in there that's gonna cause him some discomfort. So when you get to the back foot here, just keep yourself along the side of their hip. That way, if they decide to kick out, you are safely tucked around um, and they're not gonna be able to hit you from that angle. So we're just gonna pick up his back foot here. And again, it's pretty clean right now, quite dry. Again, not a bad thing unless it were to get, um, start cracking in here. So everything is clean. He doesn't really have any debris stuck in there but we're just gonna make sure sometimes rocks can hide along the cracks of the frog. And then we're just gonna go back around to his front foot here. We're gonna get him to pick it up for us. Good boy. And then again, he's just kind of got some manure along the frog line here. So we're just gonna get this picked out. Now, this doesn't hurt them. It's basically as if you were cleaning out your own nails. If you dug too deep, obviously it's gonna cause some discomfort, but the general cleaning doesn't hurt them. And we're just gonna finish again with the back foot. Good boy. Now this one's, this one's actually got quite a bit of gunk in here, so you can see. So we're just gonna go in here, get this all cleaned out. We don't want it to cause any infections. Um, if the moisture gets stuck in their hoof, it can cause thrush, yeast infections, um, and just obviously it doesn't, it doesn't feel good because eventually it will start to cause discomfort as they move around. So we're gonna get that all cleaned out. And there you go. And that's how you clean a barefoot horse.